in the unlikely event that you've made ribs and have leftovers, you can take what remains and turn it into a delicious rib slaw. Let me show you how. We'll start with the coleslaw dressing first. You're gonna need one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of pepper, one teaspoon of granulated garlic, two tablespoons of mayonnaise, one tablespoon of your favorite barbecue sauce, two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, and two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Then whisk the ingredients together very well. And no, my wife's not a surgeon. She just plays one in my videos. Go ahead and give the dressing a taste with a piece of cabbage and adjust for salt and pepper as necessary. Go ahead and set the dressing aside and take one medium sized head of cabbage. We're gonna go ahead and chop this down into bite sized pieces. Next, take four scallions and show them who's boss by giving them a fine chop. Next, we're gonna take that mythical leftover rib meat. We're gonna break it down a bit. Chop it into bite-sized pieces. Make sure you check for any little bits of bone or hard pieces. Go ahead and give the dressing we made a quick whisk to make sure it's all mixed up. Then add in the cabbage and two cups of shredded carrots. I bought these pre-shredded, but if you want to shred them yourself, knock yourself out. Finally, add the chopped scallions and give the slaw we've built so far a good mix. Now it's time to bring the rib meat into the party and mix it up real good. Add a couple more tablespoons of your favorite barbecue sauce and stir that in. Nothing left to do now except fill up a dish with some of this amazing rib slaw and enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.